You laugh. Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Good I'm afternoon. So good evening. I always say good morning. I don't know what part of the year you were or you're watching us from. You could be watching us from Australia. You could be watching us from the Philippines. You yes. could be watching us from any place in the world. You could be watching us from London, from South Africa, from Trinidad. We have friends in or all Tampa. those places or Tampa. And if it's Tampa, it's one in the afternoon. If it is Australia, it is one in the morning. But all I know is we're excited to be with you. Today we have with us uh, one of our very special uh, daughters. Um, and she, I want her to talk in a few moments. I want you guys to come on. I want you to share with your friends. Uh, share with uh, everybody that you can share with. Because I want to talk about God, enormous signs, wonders, and miracles. Yes. I believe that the God that we serve is a God of signs, wonders, and miracles. And I believe that God wants to do something amazing through you and with you and for you. Awesome. And, uh, and then at the end, I want you guys to pray with us. Uh, I want you to pray with us so that we can demonstrate a sign, wonder, and a miracle in the earth. Because I believe that God is, uh, is the God of signs, wonders, and miracles. How many people yes. believe that? How many people believe that God is a God of signs, wonders, and miracles? Amen? Absolutely. Amen. Absolutely. I believe and uh, we believe that, don't we? Yes. Don't we believe yes. that? Yes. We believe that it's just not a conference that you're doing, but that it is... Uh, somebody said, hey, family, I caught you too this time. Yes, absolutely. We're glad to catch, see that you caught us. And we're excited. Share, please share, 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 share. We love it when you guys share. And uh, I want to talk about God Norma, signs, wonders, and miracles. Yes. Now, Hello, uh, Cherise. Blessings. Um, UV. That's a beautiful name. I that's think a different I'm, name, it's huh? It's different. It's beautiful. Wow. Who, I, hope I'm pronouncing, I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly. Oh, wow. UV logo. Okay. Yes. Wow. Hello Blessings. from Miami. God bless you. Oh, wow. All right. Barbara Scott. So, Blessings. let me say this very quickly. I was looking at some of the people that were saying hello. Mm -hmm. But you guys share one more time for me. Everybody share. Everybody share. Everybody share. And um, everybody share. Everybody share. Everybody. So, uh, if you're on Periscope, I need you to share for me. If you share, uh, I need everybody to share. So what I want you to do, baby, I want you to watch Periscope, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to watch Periscope. You watch Facebook Live. The next person that shares, I'm going to bless you with something. Amen? <laughs> Every now and then, I just do that. I'll just bless you with something. The next person that shares, let me see who the next person that shares is going to be so that I can bless you. I'm looking. I'm watching. I'm waiting on somebody to share, and nobody's sharing. <laughs> there are no signs, wonders, and miracles going on with the sharing. And maybe I just don't see it. Maybe not. Let me see. Okay. It's... Let's see if who's sharing over there. I want to see who's sharing over here. Okay. Lady Pathania invited followers. Lady Pathania. Now, you one of my daughters, yeah. one of the members. <laughs> uh, and so Lady Pathania said, I'm going to get this blessing today. Okay. Okay, yes. Pathania. Uh, so you were the person that shared the last that I saw because it just kind of sh showed up. So what I'm going to do is, uh, Pathania... You call me. I'm gonna call you right after this, and I'm gonna see what you, uh, what, what you, what, what you want, and I'm gonna bless you. Hey, Kimberly Thomas. Was okay, that on that side, Kimberly Thomas shared. I think Did so. she share? Okay, Kimberly Thomas on Facebook Live shared. Yep. So you guys are gonna get something, and uh, and then the next person that did it was uh, Holy Who. Yes, you. you. Lady <laughs> Time. All right. So Lady Pathenia and Lady, Lady Time. All right. And Kimberly. Yep. I mean, and uh, what's her and name? And Kimberly Thomas. Kimberly Thomas. Okay, y'all can get something free. I mean, most of y'all already got the books and the CDs, but I'm going to bless you with something. Yes. Uh, Dr. Lanise, God bless you. How are you? We love you so much. You are uh, so amazing. One thing I love about Dr. Lanise, I know she didn't even want me to tell nobody this, but every time she sees us, anywhere she sees us, in any meeting that she ever sees us in, mm -hmm. she always blesses us. Wow. She said, yes. Pastor, I got something for you. I yes. met her, we met her in Orlando. We were at Rite, and we were standing at the counter, and she just put, put this bless me. Then when we got to Chicago, she says, I want to sow into your, your trip. And so she blessed me. So mm -hmm. I'm praying a thousandfold blessing back yes. to her. I pray doors open for her. Yes. Miraculously, that amazing things begin to happen for her like never before. Amen. Make sure you guys are sharing because you never know when I'm going to give away. I got some stuff to give away. And so I love to be a blessing to people. Uh, Radiance Bright, Bright Star, I'm going to bless you. I, I just looked up and saw you share. So I'm going to bless you. And... Uh, Somebody else says, Apostle, I share. Why well, ain't getting my blessing? I'm telling you, because it just depends on when the Spirit hit me to say, bless them for sharing. 
So tell us real quick, Nicole. I want to um, I want to give a few announcements very quickly while you guys are still coming on. Tell us about this last lunch special performance with Miss Shireen. I need to have a video, and I might show sure. a video of was it Shireen? Oh my God, she is so hilarious. Yes. And so yeah. she's going to be at your Miracle Signs and Wonders Conference on Saturday, September the 9th yes. that you're doing in St. Petersburg, Florida. Yes. Tell us more about your meeting. Tell us where you got the whole thought from Miracle Signs and Wonders. Um, one of the things that, that you, know, you know, we love to promote people in their ministries. Uh, Nicole has been so faithful. Uh, when we did the Suddenly Atlanta, I, that was one of the meetings that I've not, that was the least stressed meeting I've had. And one of the reasons for that was because Nicole really served and served well. Mm -hmm. uh, she's been a blessing to us. She runs uh, all the operations for our ministry, but she really does a lot more than that. I mean, she's a really faithful daughter uh, in the house. And so she's doing her conference and I prophesied to her this morning and I told her this is the last year that she does not have hundreds, if not thousands of people. And she's going to have hundreds, but I'm saying you're going to have more than just Two, three hundred, four hundred people. Yeah. I want to see this last be the last year that you don't have over five hundred to a thousand people at your meetings. Yes. Um, just because I really believe you're sold, you really have a heart, you really love God. It's not about anything crazy. You really want to do this because you want to see people see the signs, wonders, and miracles of God. Yeah. So tell me about that. Well, um, miracle signs and wonders really birthed from my own home because a lot of people don't know that my mother has been um, ill for the past nine years. Mm -hmm. So she suffered a major stroke and um, she's been in a nursing facility, uh, can't, can't walk, can't talk, really um, has a feeding tube, you know, her, her um, limbs are kind of under her body down to like between 98 to 100 pounds. That's usually her weight. So um, when I say miracle signs and wonders, it birthed from a place to say, okay, I, I trust God. I know that he has given me the Holy Spirit. I know that his word says I, can, I will do greater things, mm -hmm. but I need to find out what's in me that healing cannot come through my hands for my mother. Mm -hmm. So I began to search out um, the miracles. I began to search out healing to understand our um the <coughs> authority that God has given us through Christ Jesus and through the power of the Holy Spirit to operate in miracle signs and wonders. Mm. So really um as I began to plan it, God gave me the thought that we need to believe again. Mm -hmm. Our our faith um needs to arise to the level to know that this is actually what sh we should be walking in constantly. Mm. This should be our not second nature, but our first nature, mm. right? That's good. So um, it has been a, a, a faith walk for me, and God has begun to unfold his character even, even the more to say, you need to understand that greater is he that's within you than he that is in the world, and you're actually a spiritual being. You've been operating in the flesh realm as your primary uh, realm, but that is really not your primary realm. Mm. So God has really um, been pushing me to empower the saints to believe on him again mm. and believe that he wants to use you to get his works and his signs and his wonders out into the world so that others might believe. Right. Wow, I love it. Listen, if you know somebody in the Tampa Bay area, um, <clears throat> that, you know, is in a place that needs to experience the, uh, the signs, wonders, and miracles of God, mm -hmm. then I want you to invite them to this meeting uh, that's going to be this weekend. Yes, yes. So that's going to be um, at the Holiday Inn, St. Pete, Clearwater, mm -hmm. 3535 Olmerton Road, Clearwater, Florida, 33762, uh, September 8th and 9th, and uh, Miracle Signs and Wonders Conference. And I believe it's going to be amazing. you got comedians, you got psalmists, you got intercessors, you got some amazing apostles and prophets that are going to be there speaking. And if they want to register, they can go to Miracles, Miracles with an S, SignsWondersConference.com. That's Miracles, Signs, Wonders, Conference .com. Yes. And, uh Or they can contact 727-228-1489. Yes. So if you know somebody in the Tampa Bay area, now let me say this. She came to me this morning and um, she said that people were calling her. And they were asking her if she was going to cancel because of the hurricane. 
And I told her, I said, we have, we have, you have a conference named Miracle Signs and Wonders. <laughs> and you mean to tell me people asking you if you're going to cancel a conference named Miracle Signs and Wonders because of a hurricane that might come, that might be this way? And so I'm like, no, you talking about kingdom citizens with power? We had our fearless conference last year in October. Yeah. And so you were doing the fearless conference this weekend last year. Mm -hmm. And so um, people, it, a hurricane came through that time. And it was flooding, and it, we, we were on the beach where the hurricane was supposed to come to. Yes. We told the hurricane, hurricane, you can't stop here. Woo. It skips where we were and went somewhere else because right. maybe the people that were there didn't tell the hurricane it couldn't come here. But we had the power to tell the hurricane, yeah, you does. cannot yes. come to where she we're is. at. We're going to be okay. Get away from here. And the hurricane went somewhere else. Absolutely. How you going to have a fearless, fearless conference and fearless. be fearful? Exactly. Exactly. And so it was a great success. And so you always, you're going to always have those uh, people that will try to rationale. They will not walk in faith, but they will walk according to what they feel. Lady Bethina said we had a spiritual hurricane inside the conference. <laughs> hey, y'all been not messing with Lady Bethina. She done, she done yeah. won this prize and yeah. she's feeling better. And also, I, I know wanna, she's and, feeling better. I want to acknowledge Vanessa Mosley. I certainly want to um, thank you so very much. We're going to give you something as well. She shared five times. Wow. She shared how many times? Five Times. She was serious. She said, y'all yes. finna get this. Yes. My, my mother's maiden name is Mosley, so I know we were related somewhere. So, <laughs> wow. Yeah. So you. listen, we're not canceling that conference. What did you say? Jesus rebuked us the wind and the waves? Yeah. Let me tell you something. Yes. I'm rebuking the wind and waves. And I am not going to no, know this is you, you listen, we two, we two connected. This is my daughter. She's not canceling her conference. She's going to have her conference. And that storm, if I got to stand on the beach myself <laughs> with my hands on my hips and command that storm, I told the storm okay. to go away. Yes. yes, we got the power. And we can't say we got God, normal signs, wonders, and miracles, Jesus. and God doesn't do it. What is this irregularly extraordinary, out of the normal, outrageous, extraordinary in size, very large, quantity, extent, gigantic, gar gar gargantuous, mammoth, colossal, gigantic. Let me tell you, stone, go, bye. Hmm? <laughs> it's under my authority. I have jurisdiction. Jesus. Come on, I have delegated authority yes. from heaven. When I tell my puppy to sit, he sits. Yes. Now, he's kind of spoiled. Sometimes he don't See, sit. Only, only a king can decree. Right, and declare. Come on. You better know your So you better place. know your rightful place and tell the storm, look, stop. Whatever sit down. storm it is. Peace wow. be still. Absolutely. A literal storm or even a, even a, a life storm. Yes. Right. Challenges. Yes. No storm. Yes. You don't have the power. Yes. He said, I'll do greater work. You know what you said? Yes, what does it say? Miracles, signs, and wonders conference. Mm -hmm. September 8th and 9th. Mm -hmm. Come on, but this is the lifestyle you live. Yes. The other day in church, you prayed for a lady who couldn't hear and her ears popped. Right. Right. And so she could hear then. She's mm -hmm. standing with tears streaming down her eyes because you prayed for her believing in faith. Yeah. And I think the church has got to get back to that place where we take our rightful authority. You said something else powerful. You said something that really blessed me. And I always say this about my wife, and I say this about people that connect with us uh, as sons and daughters. I don't want you to just, sometimes people are praying, and their prayers only hit the roof. Yeah. Because they're praying in their flesh. Right. And our flesh can't move God, and it can't move our situation. Right. But when you tap into the fullness of your power and the anointing in the spirit realm, mm -hmm. there is something that happens. So yes. when you stand up, earth should take notice, heaven should take notice, mm -hmm. everything should take notice. Tell us about what you're doing with your prayer webinar. Yeah. So very excited about uh, this upcoming prayer webinar, the Bold Prayer Warrior and the Fearless Intercessor. Um, God has really given us a mandate. Um, ever since I was a child, uh, prayer was something that always intrigued me. I just had a desire to pray and to learn how to pray. And so over the course of these 30 plus years, God has really um, given me, uh, given both of us actually a strategic plan of prayer yeah. and wanting his children to be able to walk in the authority that he has given them as, as a prayer warrior, as a covenant um, right of, of, as being a child of God um, 
to to see breakthrough in your life every single time mm -hmm. and to know understand the dynamics of prayer understand um, the importance of prophetic intercession being able to pray the heart of God um, it's one thing to say you know I'm gonna pray for this person or that person but when you pray directly the heart of God mm -hmm. something happens and that can only be revealed through the Holy Spirit God is calling us back to a place of intimacy with him mm -hmm. he wants to reveal so many things to us but it's gonna take commitment to him in prayer he wants to reveal he wants to uncover he wants to um, release certain things to us that we can only get when we're one-on-one -on -one, when we're face to face with him when we have an audience of one and so some things are you know God has a has a grace and he releases a glory for the corporate um, setting but there's something about when you're private with God and so um, this is a time and a season that God is taking us, even with ourselves. God is taking us into a, into a new place in prayer. I, I mentioned this even over a year ago because we wrote a book and a workbook called Plug Into the Power of Prayer and Prophetic Intercession. And, and, and God began to tell me, he said, there's so much more. It's so much more that you need to learn even about prayer. And, and I began to say, I said, wow. I, I said, God, teach me. Teach me how to pray more. Teach me how to get into that place. Teach me how to war. Teach me how to travail. And that's what God is saying. He said, I'm calling my people back to a place of travail because some of the things that he has promised you have been stuck in your birth canal and you've got to get in travail in order to birth it. Wow. Girl, you about to make me give you an offering. <laughs> so you don't want, and, and it's sometimes not only do we have to give birth to what's inside of us, we have to be able to help others give birth to their promise as well. And so God is saying, I want you to begin to pray my heart. I want to hear the cry of the intercessors that's crying out even for souls. Where are the ones that are crying out for souls? Where are the ones that are crying out for families? Where are the ones that are crying out for my body? And so God wants us to come together as the body of Christ like like never before so many things that God is revealing unto us that we're going to impart into you that we're going to release um, it's going to be on the canvas um, platform and so it is the platform that many colleges and universities use. It's going to be very interactive, um, just amazing things. And so you'll be able to log in on your computer or even on your smartphone. So it's very accessible um, to you. And if by chance you're not able to make the live um, class presentation, um, you can certainly go back and review um, the recorded video. So those will, will constantly be available to you all four sessions. It starts September the 14th. Um, um, you can certainly go to our website and register or either through event B. Um, you can register event B um, dot um, bold and fearless. Um, dot com. So um, it's there. Um, also, you can also take part in our um, our prayer and um, it is the um, it's the workbook. Yeah, it's the workbook that goes along with the class. So feel free to take part in that. I, we put a, a very inexpensive package together. We really want to get the word out. We really want to get this information out to you because it's one thing to be able to you know pray. And many times we say you know God just send me someone to me send send a prophetic word to me. But God is calling us into, into such a place that He's going to deal with us face to face directly. He's yes. going to what He releases. You're not going to have to go through anybody else to get the word that God is going to release to you. But God has given you an ear to hear. He's given you eyes to see and he's given you a heart that's receptive to obey him. And that's going to take place in prayer. Wow. Let's see if I can play this video very quickly. I love to see you talk and preach and teach and minister to us. So let's see if we can. I'm going to pray with power. Do you have a call to intercession? Do you have a yearning inside of you to see breakthrough in the lives of others? If you answer yes to any of these questions, the Bold Prayer Warrior and Fearless Intercessor webinar is just for you. This interactive webinar is designed to equip you to pray boldly, intercede fearlessly, and break through every time. I am so excited for this opportunity to pour into you over 30 years of wisdom, experience, and practical application over the next four weeks. For more information on times and dates, go now to our website, www.lajanandvalora.com. You bad, girl. When I grew up, <laughs> I 
I'm going to be as bad as you. All right, y'all. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. you. Some of you have said you've already, um, registered. you've already registered. God bless you, Barbara Scott. Looking forward to having you in class. Um, so it's awesome. Amen. Now, somebody asked, where was the conference again, that you, the Miracle Signs and Wonders Conference in, uh, where was it at in Florida? And so let me give you the address again. It's at the Holiday Inn, St. Pete, Clearwater, 3535 Olmerton Road. Clearwater, Florida, 33762, September 8th and 9th. Yes. This is going to be amazing. Yes. We're excited. We're going to be there uh, to hang out and, and uh, be a part of what she's doing. Mm -hmm. um, and what day will the class be held on? It will be held on Thursdays. Uh, Thursdays. Yes. That's on Thursdays for this, for your prayer webinar. Mm -hmm. And then this meeting is it's a Friday week. and a Saturday. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. And it starts next week. So we're like eight days out. Yes. From your prayer webinar. And you're yes. like three days out. Yes. So y'all better get here. Y'all better get Don't let that storm fool you. The storm is not coming to where we are. We're going to be all right. I'm prophesying that. Yeah. I don't care where, where else it, it does something. It's not going to do something here. Amen? Amen. 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 Well, listen. Uh, I'm excited. I want to talk to you for just a few minutes uh, about miracle signs and wonders. God enormous miracle signs and wonders. Yes. God wants to do some stuff in your time and in your season and through you uh, that literally astounds those that are watching, those that are around you, those that are connected to you. We believe that this is your suddenly season. Uh, this is what this shirt says. And that God enormous suddenly shirt will be coming out this week. Praise yes, God. Because we want to see some God enormous <laughs> suddenness. We want to see suddenness that will literally blow the minds of everybody. Can you imagine that? God normal suddenly. It's coming. I see it. Do you see it? I see the shirt. And so supersize. We talk about the supersize. God wants yes. to supersize stuff for you. He wants stuff to be so big that it literally, I'm, I'm going back to what I just said again, it literally astounds the minds of, of all those that are around you. Uh, the last couple of days, I really, we talked about two things. One of the things we talked about was, and I talked to my, uh, one of my sons this morning, I was telling him about this and he laughed when I was telling him, I said, you mean to tell me that you think that sometimes we're moved by fear mm -hmm. and our fear is that God won't do what we're expecting him to do. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. the reality is, is that when God gave you the instruction, he also gave everything else. To, he doesn't give partial yeah. instructions. Right. And so when he gave you the instruction to go, he gave the instruction to whatever he told you to go to, to receive you. Not to reject you, but to receive you. Yes. So this is why when he told Peter to come and step out on the water, he simultaneously told the water to hold Peter up. Mm -hmm. When he told Peter to let the net down for the, the for the water, he simultaneously told the fish to get in the, in, in the net. Wow. When he told the woman with the issue of blood, he put it in her spirit to go. He simultaneously knew, God knew that Jesus in the earth had the power to be able to heal her. And so he told the virtue to go out of him and go into her and heal her when he told her to go. And so every situation, when God gives you a command, he gives a corresponding action and, and, and reaction to, to whatever it is that's supposed to supply your need. And so if something in the earth is supply, supposed to supply your need, when he tells you to go, he tells that thing in the earth to supply your need. I have a need. And so when I have the need, God has already prepositioned a cache of your supply in the earth somewhere. You just have to tap into it. So we have a need. As a minister, we had a need, right? And so when we had this need, God tells me to make a phone call. So I, call, uh, the, I called my bank and I said, listen, this is what I want to be able to do. I called the bank, uh, the, 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 the branch manager of the bank. And I said, this is what I need to be able to do. And he says, okay, no problem. So then when I go to my meeting, my plan is for one of them to be sitting there with me. And so it gives overwhelming success in whatever you're coming to do. Are you listening to me? So God will give you strategy. And so that's what I'm praying. God, give your people strategy today. Strategy. Give them strategy. Because it's not that you don't have an idea. It's not that you don't have a vision. Now God needs to get order your steps and give you strategy and give you connections and give you people who will connect with you to give you wisdom to be able to access what's already yours. The yes. stuff is already yours. Everything in the earth that belongs to you is already yours. Yes. There is no money. I say this all the time. There is no money that has left the earth. They are making more money right now. So you don't have a money problem. You have a vision problem. You have a strategy problem. You don't have a relationship problem. You have a vision problem and a strategy problem. Yes. You don't have uh, you, you, you don't have a ministry church growth problem. Mm -hmm. You have a, a, a vision problem and a strategy problem. Jesus. So we got to pray for God to give us vision and strategy. And not only that, we need to pray for God to give us his vision and then teach us how to close our mind down and pick up the mind of Christ. We got to learn how to close our speaking down and yes. pick up the mouth Jesus. and the mind and the speaking of Christ Jesus. because when we do that, we'll tap into our purpose. 